U.S. is ready to strike Taliban and is looking for bases to keep an eye on Afghanistan. According to reports, United States Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff General Mark Milley met his Russian counterpart, Chief of the Russian General Staff General Valery Gerasimov in Helsinki on Wednesday apparently to discuss the use of bases in the Afghan neighborhood in Central Asia to maintain surveillance over activities of Daesh. The Russians are not open to the idea. The Americans fear that Daesh will regroup in a year or two and strike the United States. The other option for the Americans is to use the military bases in the Gulf to launch aerial strike over the horizon. But experts seem to feel that it does not provide enough tactical advantage. The Russians are apprehensive that the Taliban in power in Afghanistan would destabilize the Central Asian republics, which were formerly part of the erstwhile Soviet Union, to the north. Though these former Soviet republics are independent, they continue to be in the Russian sphere of influence. Kyrgyzstan and Uzbekistan, under Russian pressure the two had asked the United States to close the operating bases in their territory. In the meeting of the generals, Russia made it clear that American military presence in the Central Asian region would change a lot of things, as it would relations between Russia and America. It is a surprise, and perhaps it should not come as a surprise at all, that the Americans are planning ways to maintain surveillance over Afghanistan, and they are making a provision for aerial strikes if there are signs that Daesh is regrouping. This also makes evident that the Americans do not trust the Taliban to keep their word that they would not allow any extremist group to operate from Afghan territory.